Hello guys, Dave here, founder of SuperThread and welcome to my latest SuperThread walkthrough. So SuperThread is a super fast task tracker that has tasks and docs together that's easy to use for a multifunctional team. So let's say developers working with designers and product managers working together. That kind of gives you this ability to have a really good overview of what's going on, whatever your level inside of the company. So SuperThread is organized inside of workspaces and here you have a workspace. Workspace is normally your company or your group. Then underneath you have the spaces and spaces is where the work happens. Spaces can be private which means that only the members that you invited can view and edit stuff inside of them or they can be public to the workspace which means that all the members of the workspace can actually go inside and view and edit stuff. You can browse spaces by clicking here and you can join and leave spaces or create spaces. It's real nice and easy. So here we have a space called product. Um, a space can be anything like a team or a project or a client. And inside of it, you can see we have boards and then pages. And basically uh, boards uh, is where the tasks are and pages is where the documentation is and the pages themselves can contain uh, sub pages. So you can organize these boards by moving them up and down. Um, it's really easy. And but the cool thing is you can do the whole thing inside of the sidebar. So if you move a, a board down, it changes here as well. And the same goes for pages. So you can do it either here or here. The cool thing about this space homepage is that you can actually prioritize tasks easily in there. So if I have a roadmap board and a product triage board, I can move tasks from one to the other real nice and easy. So now you can go inside of the board and have this full view. Right now we are viewing it in Kanban view, but you can also have a list view or a timeline view, which is really nice for roadmaps where you can adjust start and end date. The boards themselves contain columns and cards and the cards, as well as everything else, opens up instantaneously. So there's no waiting time. And then if you click in there, you can edit together in real time with other team members. Otherwise, they have everything you'd imagine. You can upload files, you can have estimates, priority, you can have dependencies. It's really nice and powerful, as well as tags. The other cool thing about cards is that they contain child cards or they can contain child cards. If you look at this one here, it has child cards, which are children of this particular epic, if you like. And as you can see, these child cards, they live in their own respective boards. So here we have design backend and front end working together to achieve this epic. You can hold down shift and mouse over anything. You can see what's inside or you can click on it. It'll take you straight there. As well as moving cards or boards left, right, you can also take a card from here and move it to a different board. So say, for example, I want to move this card to this board here. So all I have to do is just drag it on there. Um, I can also move it to a board which is inside of a different space. So all I have to do is hover over the space, wait for it, it expands, and then I can just drop it inside of any of these boards. When it comes to boards, pages, cards, or anything else, you can favorite them. And if you favorite them, you can jump to anything really quick. You see? So now let's talk about pages. And the pages are contained inside of spaces as well. And the pages themselves can have child pages. So if you look at this page called spec, or specs rather, if you click on it, it has a lot of child pages, which you can see here or here. You can order them here. And as I order them here, they change here. And you can quickly jump to any of them um, in an instant. There's no waiting time whatsoever. You can also highlight anything inside of these pages and add an inline comment, which helps with collaboration. Otherwise, the same as cards, you can actually have multiple people collaborating on the same page. If you want to mention anything inside of a page, whether it's a person or a card or anything, do at and type specs. You can actually, you know, mention anything in there. So, and then you can jump to it real quick, like so. Then you have notifications. Notifications is where you get notified if somebody mentions you and you can jump to the card straight away. You can add a comment. You can reply in line, which is really nice and powerful. And moreover, you can search for anything. You can just do command K and type shipped and it'll find you the stuff that's either pages, cards, boards, and then you can just click on it and go to it straight away. 